Hello and welcome to HCG Corporate Designs. This video is about the overprint of white text. I want to show you in an example of my daily work how um, the overprint of white text affects the desktop publishing process. I designed a catalog for the Münchner Stofffrühling 2014, which is a big textile fair in Munich. And in the course of, of designing that catalog, I had to place a full page advertisement from Ralph Lauren Home. Now I got sent this uh, advertisement as two separate files. I got a JPEG file as my background photo, as my background picture, and I got sent the logo of Ralph Lauren Home as a vector file for Adobe Illustrator. And now I want to show you here in InDesign how that looks. Well, first of all, let me mention, as I'm a German native speaker, all my software is in German, but I will do my very best to translate that for you into English. So, here I placed my picture, my JPEG file, and here I placed the logo as a vector file. And um, here is my pre-flight. Pre-flight is a warning system in InDesign, so to speak, and it gives you alerts if something cannot be printed properly. So when I open my pre-flight here, by double-clicking on it, I have my standard profile and it gives me a green light. That means everything should be fine. But don't trust this standard profile. I will show you um, a profile that I manually set up for printing purposes. And here you see I have a red light, I have an alert for uh, the overprint of white in that logo. So that means when I go here to Ansicht, which is view in English, and I go to the overprint preview, I see that home is printed but the Ralph Lauren writing is not printed or is, is overprinted by the background picture, what I, of course I don't want. So the first step is to really um, set a, a pre-flight that shows you that alert because otherwise you don't find out. What I do is I go here into my pre-flight system, I define a profile, here I already defined mine which is called Blickpunkt, and here you can set um, color pre-flights. You go on to Farbe or color and here further down it says something like uh, it shows you or it gives you an alert if white or paper color is overprinted. You really have to activate that, click on OK and then you get an alert from pre-flight if something is overprinted. But always make sure that when you work in InDesign that the correct pre-flight uh, profile is activated because the normal pre-flight profile is the Grundprofil or standard profile and if you work with that, as I already said, you don't see any alerts. We have to solve the core problem in the source file in Adobe Illustrator. I inserted a red background here as a new layer, as you can see, so we can see the white logo better. When I go on view again and over print preview, I can check once again, yes, it really is not printed. Home is printed, but Ralph Lauren is not printed. Not very clever. So, I select Ralph Lauren, then I go on Fenster, which is Windows, on Attributes. And here I can see Fläche überdruckung, uh, print, uh, overprint, sorry, is activated. I want to deactivate that because I don't want my white Ralph Lauren letters to be overprinted by the background. When I go into view, overprint, preview again, I see Ralph Lauren and home both are printed correctly now. Back in InDesign, I have to relink the corrected Illustrator file, of course. So this is still selected. Let me change to the normal preview again. So this logo is selected. I go to my links and I link it with the corrected file that we edited in Adobe Illustrator. I have to amend that slightly again so it looks fine. Okay, so View, over print preview, looks fine as you see. Let me go back to the normal preview and also my um, manually preset pre-flight profile gives me green light and says only failure without mistakes. So that's very good. So this way we can finally print this file without any mistakes. 
Now that I recorded my InDesign file into a print PDF file, I can again check in my Acrobat how this is printed and if I have any problems or not. So here I exported, of course, the file with the correct, with the manually edited um, vector logo. I go to Bearbeiten, which is Edit in English, and again, as you can see, here I have another pre-flight system, another warning system. And in this pre-flight system, I have a category that is called PDF Analysis. And at the very bottom of this PDF Analysis category, I have Show Potential Overprinting Problems. I go on Check, now it calculates a little bit, and now it means, and now it says, keine Probleme gefunden. No problems found. This is always very nice to hear when you're producing a print PDF. So this is fine. Let me show you, just um, for comparing it, the other file. I corrected, or I, I, I exported also the other InDesign file with my overprint problem logo, so to speak. When I do the same PDF preflight check here, it shows me, when I double click on it, where my problem is. So this is overprinted, this is overprinted by the background picture. So it's very nice that you can check any overprint problems in Illustrator, in InDesign and again at the very end in Acrobat. I hope this video was helpful for you. If you like it, please share it. I wish you a very nice day and thanks for watching.